everyone, I'm Allie. Today I'm going to talk about the luteal phase of the female monthly cycle and foods that help promote maximum hormone health during this phase, as well as show you guys how to prepare a delicious recipe um, to eat during this phase. During the luteal phase, progesterone starts to rise. This starts about day 17 to 18, right after ovulation. What this means is in the beginning of your luteal phase, um, you still have quite a bit of energy, but towards the end, your energy starts to decline and you may start experiencing PMS symptoms. Irritability, bloating, mood swings, just a decline in energy, cravings for food not good, right? So there are foods that can actually help to promote maximum hormone health that will alleviate many of these symptoms. Number one, magnesium. This is gonna help to reduce bloating. You can get this from dark leafy greens, such as collard greens, watercress, kale, any of those yummy delicious goodnesses. Number two is B complex and you can get this from root vegetables. My favorite is sweet potato and sweet potato also helps to produce serotonin. So if you're feeling a lot of mood swings and irritability, eating some sweet potatoes or other earthy root vegetables will help your body produce serotonin so you feel happier. Next is fiber. That's the third one. So fiber is really important because during this time as your progesterone rises, um, estrogen levels might be too high as well. So if you're eating foods with fiber in it, it's gonna help to decongest the large intestine and flush out that excess of estrogen. Foods that you can eat that have a lot of fiber are brown rice along with all the root veggies. I'm gonna now show you guys in my kitchen how to make a delicious recipe that's gonna have tons of magnesium and calcium and foods rich with fiber to help you during this phase so you are feeling good with none of these PMS symptoms. So I'm gonna show how to make a delicious wrap for the luteal phase. We're gonna be making a rice out of parsnips some radishes, collard leaves that we're gonna be using to create the actual wrap, some baby kale to stuff in the wrap. So now we've got the magnesium from both the two greens that we're using. All of the root vegetables have fiber too, so this is the perfect luteal meal and I can't wait to show you guys. Nature's beauty. <laughs> I'm gonna be making the rice out of parsnips. I'm just gonna chop them up and put them into the food processor with the S blade and add some flavor, some spices, and it's gonna create a nice white fluffy rice. So we wanna pulse this. We don't wanna over pulse this to make it completely blended. We wanna pulse it until it's very fine, like a rice texture, but still fluffy. That's the consistency you want. Lastly, we're gonna make our walnut meat. So this is gonna be the base of our wrap. With these spices, this is gonna give it kind of a taco meat flavor. So now it's assembly time. So I'm gonna use this collard leaf to be my burrito wrap. I don't wanna use this really thick stem, so I'm going to kinda of chop the bottom off and then I'm gonna slice the top of the stem off. Now we're gonna add in our ingredients. Ready to wrap it? So we're gonna pinch in the sides of the leaf and fold it over and tuck it under. And we have our nice little burrito wrap. You can cut it in half. Check that out. Should I taste it? Mmm, that's good. <laughs> Thanks for watching this video. Please show your love by liking this video and share the love by sharing it with your friends. 
stay tuned. There'll be more videos coming up and it was a pleasure showing you how to create these wonderful foods for each phase of your cycle and have a great day.